seals are good, oxygen's good. Just do what you did last time, and you're fine. Follow my one simple rule. Hella, what's my one simple Listen rule? Listen to Lynn. Boss lady knows best. Exactly. Listen to me. Mining's just like any other job. Go steady, go safe, go home with a pocket full of credits at the end of the day. Yeah, totally. It's just like, um, now I work in the Stardock. Except, uh, with more cave-ins, lasers, and accidental dismemberment. Very helpful. Thank you. Ah, you're gonna be fine. Your first outing was solid. And, you know, let's be honest, it ain't exactly astrophysics. That's why I keep him around. Good pep talks. Yeah. And the fact that I can pinpoint a helium deposit from 300 meters. <laughs> Not untrue. A shame we won't find any down here. But the metal deposits alone should pay for our own helium. Hell, after this, we'll have enough jump fuel to bounce from one end of the settled systems to the next. Hey, more minerals, more money. And so the cycle repeats itself. Just no more unauthorized jumps in the house for room space, okay? He's just a big baby. There are worse lives. You know, most Dusties don't even make it this far. I have a good feeling about you. Right, group hug now or at the end of the shift? <sighs> one of these days, Hella, I am going to leave. Hide. Promises, promises. All right, what's up, guys and gals? We are here today with Starfield. The game just came out recently. Figured I'd check it out. Okay. Let's see, what see if I can got. trust Bethesda How again. After Fallout 76, uh, it's Grab some samples. it's a hard oh, pass. Uh, but not you. Check on Isabel. Make sure she eases up on the breach. I don't feel like getting buried alive today. Roger that. Remember, Dusty, keep your breathing steady, and never take that helmet off down here. Oxygen processors don't extend this far. Yeah, because God forbid we drill on a rock with breathable atmosphere. Know what I love about working in Free Star Collective space? Fewer regs. A job like this in the United Colonies? Huh. Dreams of living. Ugh, look at this one over here. Calvin, what are you no. doing, man? Ah, no, no, no! It's a laser, not a sledgehammer! Ease up! Yeah, that's right. Benning, if you got paid for a break, you'd be a millionaire! Let's go! Yeah, yeah, okay. What do we say, Dusty? You make your cut, you get your cut. No exceptions. Come on, pick it up! Troy, what's the yield? Minimal at this point. Occasional glimmer, but it's weak. What do you think? Stay the course? No, ma'am. Juice ain't worth the squeeze. Well, okay then. Let's call this one tapped. Why don't you move over to that big vein we looked at? Yes, ma'am. get this done so far this game looks phenomenal like the detail i look like it just looks like i'm in an actual cave like these rocks look like rocks real great all right let's see what we gotta do here what does that do Is that a focuser oh, okay okay the left stick makes it focus Sucker, you to join. Fall for the fancy. They're ready for us. Get back up here. I'm busy. Is anyone else to bother? Oh, I'm gonna get all the minerals I can. I suggest anybody plan to do the same. Probably worth a lot. Don't. 
out. Oh, it looks so nice. It's running well, too. Probably getting around 70, 80 frames right okay, now. Okay, now you're starting to freak me out. Relax. It's just another job. Come on. We're getting close, I think. Yeah, everything is just... <laughs> Lynn, seriously, uh, there's something really effed up about this. Where is it, Hella? Through there, I think. Okay, you, you're up. Something Explore goes wrong the in there. We'll come get you. Uh, All right. Why, why would anything go wrong? Would you shut up? Both of you do your jobs. The client is on his way. There we go. Nice little flashlight. All right. Mining job. <laughs> I'm gonna get all the minerals I can. Well, I hope you guys are, uh, you guys and gals are having a wonderful day so far, or night, whatever time it is, wherever you are. Uh, I decided to pick this one up early, try to make some parts here and there. I'm gonna be playing the entire main quest line, and I heard it has a new game plus, so I'm going to. Play the main quest line and then I'll do New Game Plus and then focus on the side quests. I'll be making videos about everything. I also have a bunch of mods installed. If uh, anybody watching wants some assistance with mods, just let me know in the comments and I'll make a video tutorial on how to mod it because I'm using the Game Pass PC version and it's a little bit different from Steam. Just kind of let me know. I got you guys. Looks like there was a different kind of mineral there. I don't know what it was. It wasn't telling me when I was picking it up. Kylumite deposit. Looks expensive. Oh, I can take it. Okay. Oh, here we go. <laughs> the field of view makes it look okay. weird. Take it easy. You were out cold. Uh, no physical damage. Mentally, the jury's still out. You know who you are? New recruit for Argos Extractors? Ring any bells? Any of this look familiar? Oh, nice. Nice. I like that. Okay. And that whole intro there just reminds me. Oh, you're, you're finally awake. Alright. It's kind of cool, though. I like that. Let's see. I have some written down numbers for how I want my character to be. Pretty simple, simple hairstyle. OK. 
color. I don't want to take too long. I want to make sure I get this right. And then I can just move right on. Oh yeah, I definitely. Bounty Hunter. I I saw the Bounty Hunter in the trailers, the Gamescom, whatever you call it. And I saw Bounty Hunter and I was like, I gotta have it. I'm definitely gonna be a Bounty Hunter. Alright, what we got? Alien DNA. Dream home. You own a luxurious, customizable house on a peaceful planet. Unfortunately, it comes with a $125,000 credit mortgage with Galbank that has to be paid weekly. Okay. You know, I'm curious. I want to see what that looks like. Empath. Nah, extrovert, of course. The adoring fan. Oh, man. The old days. I remember how many thousands of different ways I killed this man in oblivion. Let's see. Uh, what do I want? Definitely want that one. I like that one. Someone put a price on your head and word has spread. Occasionally, armed mercenaries will show up and try to kill you, but being cornered gives you an edge. When your health is low, you do extra damage. That's awesome, man. You know, people show up and you want to kill them, it's free money. Free loot. And then you get a you get a boost of damage if your health is low. That's great. Alright, so I've I've seen a few of these. In the uh, the trailer breakdowns, if you just kind of pause them and you look at them, you can see and read and figure out what you want to do with your character before you even play. Uh, it's kind of something of what I did. I'm definitely going to get this one. And we're going to finish up. I'm going to try and get through here as fast as possible and get this going. He him. <laughs> All right. My name from here on out for any character I ever make will always be Tommy Score. That is my name. Tommy Score. That is right. Confirm. Here we Bet go. You were expecting a quiet job compared to your last gig. Bounty hunter turned space miner. Huh. Absolutely. Well, you got the sample. Client's on his way. Then we all get paid. You remember anything that happened? Ah, oh, it was incredible. Like a dream or a vision. Easy there, High Flyer. Probably just the endorphins kicking in when you passed out. Don't go having an experience on me. You'll walk it off. More importantly, <laughs> I already had the experience. What we were looking for. All this trouble for that stupid thing? Huh. Sure don't look like much. Never mind what it looks like. It's worth more than this mine has pulled in all month. We'll be... Speak of the devil. Uh oh, what we got? Oh man, uh, anybody watching, one thing you gotta understand about games like this is you gotta loot. That's for sure. I'm definitely gonna pick up anything that I think might be useful. I suggest you do the same valuables or items that could be used to make something else. I'm definitely doing that. What we got here? Hey, I'm just saying they got a reputation. Wire spool, vacuum tape. I bet most people just blast right through this. Whoa. You don't look good. Yeah, if you guys want to read that, you can pause it. I'm not big on the little audio logs and stuff. You got a few more digs to go before I feel like talking to you. Well, screw you too. Argos usually ain't so good at picking sights. Oh, this time, like a miracle. Why are you people talking to me? All right, let's see. Talk to him. Yeah, all right. Sparkling water. Need some coffee or something? Got a packet. Right, I already got coffee. Just trying to get through my shift. 
value 155 credits for a deck of cards. Wow. 240? Lynn sure seems to like another cutter. Guess she would know. Being the boss and all. Here we go. Supervisor's log number two. Supervisor's log supplemental. Still day two of Argos Extractor's Vectera dig. Restart collective claim ID beta seven five four eight alpha. As far as anyone knows, this is just another ore run. Vectera's got enough mid-level veins to keep everyone working and not asking questions. I've told Hella everything he needs to know. Which is pretty much everything I know. That this is another one of Barrett's special orders. He made good with the payment for Kazal, even if it was a bust. This time, I'm not so sure. This place is giving me the willies. I think we're going to find... something. I just have no idea what it could be, or why Barrett might want it. But those sweet constellation credits Fitting in mean okay? we dig our own and keep our mouth shut. Okay with that. Hopefully, between Barrett's mysterious thing and the ore itself, we'll be done with this rock in five days, when the transport is supposed to come back for extraction. Oh, that's a long audio log. Alright, we got another one right here. It's Heller's personal log number two. Personal log. Heller. Argos extractors. I figured back Terra for your standard moon. Looks like I was misinformed. Lynn just filled me in on what we're really doing here. Looks like Lynn's got another, what's the word she used? Discreet contract with that Barrett guy. He says there's something special here. He's paying top dollar for us to find it, rip it out, and deliver it. No questions asked. I have, of course, been honoring this arrangement by asking Lynn a ton of questions. She's playing it close to her sweaty old best, as usual. But a guy does have to wonder, what the hell does special even mean in this case? We're on a moon, in the middle of nowhere. Either this guy wants to make jewelry from some rare space diamonds, or there's some kind of ancient alien death weapon buried here. If it's diamonds, I'm totally stealing uh, one we'll to be give done to Jennifer, here soon. or Carlos. Oh, I hear this is the last dig. And if it's a death weapon, I get to shoot it first. What? Those are my terms. Oh, I'm working. I'm glad when we're off this. Okay, then. Uh, ping pong ball. Personal groomer. All right, there we go. Hundred dollar. Iso centered magnet. Okay. What we got cheddar snack crackers. Hell yeah. Base suit. Uh, what we got? What we got? Did you pick? Don't hey. get too used to how easy this has been. Next dig might be toxic hazards or worse. I'm not coming back, lady. Personal groomer again. There we go. I'm making all the monies when I sell everything. Get away from me. All right. So, uh, I noticed, um, it's taking a minute, but I wanted to make sure we could all listen to the audio logs before I spoke. But apparently there is a master locked cage here with something that looks very valuable in there. Um, I can't, I can't, uh, do it. This lock is too difficult. Very unfortunate. Probably have to come back to this place one day. I wonder if it's like Fallout, where it's got the cryolator behind a master lock. That's so annoying. Gotta come back later. Keep in the back of our minds here. Alright, so now that's done with. Found an interesting spot. Everybody can remember that and go to it when it's needed. All right, Dusty. Go ahead and progress. Airlock. Put your helmet on. Put my helmet on. Oh, it's not on. Inventory. Helmet. Well, there we go. All right. That might be why I couldn't turn my flashlight on earlier. Yeah. Let's do this. All right, guys. We going to Megaton first. I think it's probably in that general direction. Hey.
Oh, what an insult. Older than this moon. Ooh, a pistol. Oh, I'm definitely getting that. Hold up. Let me put that on. You have to get used to that. There we go. Alright, so I'm thinking what I'll do is I'll just kind of speed through looting processes, you know, because I don't really talk all that much. Um, unless something interesting is found or happens, I'll just speed through most of the looting just to kind of progress, because I know that it's probably not very interesting to watch. You could call it that. <laughs> that fun, huh? Not the most gentle push into the great mysteries of space, but hey, been there. Look, just hand over the credits, and I'll be happy to never see this thing, or you, ever again. That's why I like you, Lynn. All business. Barrett, the scanners on the frontier are reporting a ship coming in hot from orbit. I really thought I lost them. Oh, hello. What are these, pirates? Oh, hold off the pirate. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. Ooh, that aim. Quack, quack, quack. Super fast. Quick draw. Oh, there's a bunch of them. Oh. Come on. Get out of here. Oh my gosh. Keep staggering me. Get out of here. Your health is low. Yeah, clearly. Alright, what do we got? I'm gonna have to get the hang of these controls. <laughs> this man is crawling. Yeah, that's right. I'm gonna go back and uh, I'm gonna go back and loot everything, and when I get done looting everything, back through there and all these guys and all that, I'm gonna cut it and continue the quest line. One sec. All right, here we go. Good to go. Of course, Barrett was being followed. Well, that was some fine work on the pressure. You took Think so? the artifact, right? That means you saw it. The visions. You're coming with me to Constellation. Yeah, all You're three seconds of them. Mm. If they can tell me what this artifact of yours is, I'm in. Marvelous. Oh no, Barrett. No. You think you're just going to take off after the mess you caused? Oh, right. 
I guess I did just put you all on the Crimson Fleet hit list. How about I stay and I send your Dusty here in my place? I, I, I know, I know, but he's not some miner anymore, Lynn. Soon as he touched that rock, something changed. Don't tell me you can't feel it. Fine. It's a deal. Get out of here, Dusty. You're on to bigger things. Thanks for everything, Lynn. Just go. Before I say something I regret. Well, now that that's settled. Vasco, get him to the lodge. No deviations unless absolutely necessary, okay? Protocol Indigo. Indigo? Again. Very well. Oh, and hey, take this. You'll find it very useful out there. And it even tells the time. Oh, part of my arm's missing. Oh, this field of view is hey, ridiculous. Look at that. The watch fits you perfectly. Now, questions? What we got? You're giving me your ship? Technically, it's not even mine. Consider it alone. Vasco will keep you on course. Besides, I'm making an exception, since you can tell Constellation about that vision you had. Hmm, what exactly did we dig up? That, my friend, is the million credit question. And Constellation can find the answer. With your help. Okay. Uh, why was the Chrism fleet after you? They're just following the loop, like pirates do. Uh -huh. And I have something of a reputation as a loot collector. <laughs> Alright. Who are you and what's Constellation? See, that's the problem with the settled systems. Too easy to take everything for granted. While everyone else is busy playing politics, we're the ones braving the unknown, charting the vastness of space. Without us, the galaxy is just a big room with the lights turned out. All right. And Vasco, don't let him break my ship. <laughs> All right, let's do this. Look how that thing moves. Oh my. Boing, 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 boing. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. I get to fly a ship in a Bethesda game. Amazing. We got any more loot? Oh, okay. Alright, let's board this bad boy. Captain Tommy. Okay. <laughs> Don't use. Nice. Oh, we got a research station here. What is this? The research lab lets you discover new crafting recipes by completing research projects. Each research project requires materials in order to make progress. The materials needed can range from raw minerals extracted from planets to organic substances extracted from alien creatures and plant life to manufactured components that can be made at an industrial workman. Okay. And I'm assuming we can just add these things to our ship as we progress. Probably way down the line. Alright. Go ahead and move on here. Gonna heal up real quick and see. We'll learn how to fly this sucker. Ooh. Look at that. Beautiful. Shields ready. The rest is up to you. All right. Let's take off. Cutscene taking off. How's y'all's, uh, anybody who's already playing, how's y'all's experience going so far? You can let me know in the comments. I'd love to talk about it back and forth. 
now that we are in orbit, oh, really? it might be wise to test all controls and systems to ensure they are not on the verge of catastrophic failure. I can step you through the entire process, or if you're already okay. an experienced pilot, just power up all the systems and we'll be on our way. Oh. You to select a ship system to allocate power. Yeah, I just learned how to allocate power. You can skip the ship tutorial by powering up all systems, including the grav drive. Okay. Okay. A on a ship requires power. Allocating power is under your direct control. Let's go over the engines. Engines control our maximum speed. Try increasing and decreasing our relative velocity. Okay. We can go faster. A ship's and engine then has a sweet spot slower. for better handling during turns. Draw your attention to the HUD. You'll notice a speed indicator in the lower left with a gauge that goes up and down as you adjust the throttle. Try to center the gauge so that it lines up with the center of the vertical bars to its right. Uh. Boosts can be engaged for temporary bursts of speed. Okay. Ooh, wow. Up all my boost. Okay, it regenerates. Try adjusting power to the shields. Notice more power increases their strength. Shields protect the ship from hull damage. Without a hull, but be vaporized. Shield health is displayed in the lower right. Hull damage is below it. Okay. There we go. An adequate pilot. Are you familiar with ship combat tactics? Ooh. Because that's a crimson fleet ship bringing its weapons to bear. We will need to disable their shields. Laser based weaponry is particularly effective. If you can keep the enemy ship centered Ooh. on the HUD, Log in to fire a homing missile. The enemy do you do that? are down, Captain. Ballistic weaponry excels at damaging the hull once shields are offline. Oh, that's how you do that. Okay. You guys are screwed now. I got rockets. Ooh, okay. Congratulations on surviving your first Starship assault, Captain. We should search the wreckage for spare parts and other salvage. You will need to okay. fly close to it before we can access the remains. Platinum, okay. Is that all I got? Credits and platinum? Okay then. Ooh. Oh. Oops. Alright, what are we doing now? Oh no. Oh no. Get away from him real quick. Turn around and hit him. There we go. What we got? What we got? down. Oh no. Uh, I get used to how to do this. The ship combat's crazy. Got 
die. Yeah, clearly. The odds of continual assault from their ships are high enough to jeopardize our mission. In short, they are after a frontier and will not stop. Ooh. We will need to deal with the local Crimson Fleet captain. A recent scan indicates an abandoned facility on the nearby moon of Crete, a perfect staging area for pirates. Alrighty. Oh, it's so slow. Okay. Got here. Okay. I'm gonna just take everything and try to move on. Where do I gotta go? I gotta go all the way over there. Travel between the stars, zoom out to see the entire star system, zoom out again to see all the stars in the settled systems. Alright, plot a course by selecting the star system you want to travel to. Your ship can only jump so many light years at once, so distant star systems may require you to jump to a closer star first. Okay. Alright. Okay, where do I... There we go. I gotta go there. Crete. Travel to Crete. Okay. Let's see. Uh, set landing. Okay. Travel. Oh, there we go. Okay. Figured it out. It'll take a minute to get used to. Oh, here we go. That was quick. We have arrived in orbit. The abandoned facility with our Crimson Fleet captain is on the surface. Uh, am I getting any closer to it? Or... I'm assuming I gotta... Planet view of the star map gives you information about the environment, lets you scan the planet for resources and helps you discover key landing sites. Rotate the planet until the Crete Research Lab map icon is in view. Then select the map icon to land there. Okay, I can scan it. What we got? Ooh. A lot of resources. All right, uh, set landing and land. Okay, that's simple enough. How are you guys doing so far? You guys enjoying your time? Enjoying your day, your night? Well, I can just exit the ship, right? All right. Oh, what is that? Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you guys. Let's see. Oh, no, this one. Okay, so... When I was looting one of the pirates earlier, I got lucky. I got a mirrored deep mining pack. It is legendary. That's the earliest time I've ever gotten a legendary before. Awesome. It's real nice. It lets me uh, do a basic boost pack. Which is, I guess, kind of helpful. I haven't really learned how to use it that well. Oh, 
All right. Yeah, I got. I wonder if there's any resources I can try and get here. Uh... Be careful, Captain. Alien creatures are often unpredictable. Oh, hello. I did not know you were there. Scan creatures, minerals, and plants. Each unique item scan progresses your survey data of the planet. Completed survey data can be sold for credits. Oh. Sounds like No Man's Sky, oh my gosh. The scanner mode also unlocks additional features such as building outposts and using social skills like diplomacy and intimidation. Really? Weird. What is that? Can I scan it or? I gotta get, ooh, ooh. Hey bro, uh. I don't want no beef, man, but I I wanna I wanna scan you. I don't know if Oh. Hey bro. Um you're like level five. Oh, okay. I understand. Uh, I see you're you're saying go the f away. <laughs> Whoa! Sir! How dare you attack my buddy? I mean, that was kind of cool, little little threat threat show there. Okay. Oh, can I scan it now though? Since it's dead. Thirteen percent scanned. Am I doing this wrong? Like, I'm thinking it might be like No Man's Sky, where like you just look at them and then you can scan them, but it's not, it's not letting me scan them. Unless it's already scanned. I don't really know. Uh, I don't know. The scanner's showing me there's something over there. Um, this is kind of confusing. Oh, we got iron. Yeah, I'll go ahead and pick up some iron. Why not? I can speed through this. Okay, so it progresses as you scan more of them. So I need to find like multiple of the same thing for it to actually like get it. I'll check out that place a little later. I'm gonna go ahead and progress. I'll make some progress here. Don't wanna take too long doing things. say if I do uh, trail off and try to find some loot and if I don't find any I'll just speed through so you guys don't have to sit through it I do not understand your attachment to all these objects <laughs>
feet. We got little loot containers here. Gold pyramid sculpture. Yeah, a lot of stuff here is worth a lot. Or I might think it is. I'll find out later how much things really are. Omega the last day. Oh, look at that. Yeah, with this field of view, since they didn't have a field of view slider, I downloaded a mod for it, and, you know, it's it's interesting because it, it's like it's not really compatible. Uh, the field of view for me right now is, is awesome. I like it. I got it at like 120. Um, but it seems to like interfere with some things, like my arm seems to be like disappearing sometimes depending on like the cinematic that plays and when I'm looting things or if I'm using my flashlight here it's like really small flashlight uh, if I ever find something that lets me adjust the flashlight size I'll definitely do that What is that? Can I scan it? No. Oh my god. Okay. We got. Right. Synthamy turkey. Sounds like some stuff we're gonna be eating in the future for real. Oh, they're making that fake meat. All right. Oh, molecule extractor. There we go. We're gonna twenty value. Yeah, I don't really like using the scanner. You know, like I like. Um actually finding the items rather than it just being shown to me there we go some digi pick might need those later this place is real ominous oh oh there's a dead guy nickel <laughs> all right History of Xenobiology. Alright. I must have all the loots. I don't know how valuable things are. Hello? Anybody here? Oh, there we go. Amp. Snack pack, protein bar. Yeah. I like protein bars. You guys like protein the bars? Whoa. Who was that? Beer. What is a pirate? He's running at me, sir. Get away from me, or ma'am. Where you at? Come on. You got a laser weapon? Can I like finish you off or like oh ow that was rude I got a purple weapon that's cool let's check that out in a little bit
Oh, there's too much. There's too much loot making me go crazy. Can't, I can't do this. Can't do this. Oh my gosh. The FOMO is so bad right now. Milk. There's milk next to the toilet. Antibiotic. Nice. Those are usually pretty valuable. Well, that's good to know. Where are you guys at? Ooh, that's cool. The cards. What we got? UC Battle Meal Multi Pack. Wow, plus eight carry capacity for eight minutes. All right. See this? This is what happens when you you know you loot. You know, it might be tedious, but it definitely it's definitely rewarding, for sure. Oh, hello. Yeah, I see. Fill in all open slots in every layer to open the lock. Select a key and rotate it until it lines up with the gaps in the security layer. Slot the key to fill in the gap. Each key can only be used once. Okay, it's like a little puzzle here. So if I do that one, and then I do, wait, can I like, Oh, I can choose a different one. Okay. Okay. That was simple enough. Modified bracket. Wow. That thing looks crazy. I'll take all. And a digi pick. And then I. Just in case I messed up. How nice of them. Blue lab outfit. Okay. Looks like I'm gonna be selling like so much stuff. Bed. Okay. Oh, there's another UC meal. Alright, I'm gonna check out that gun real quick. Oh, wrong button. Let's see. What we got? We got. This sucker right here, that uh, plus 20% damage against robots. 25% increase in attack speed. Wow. That's crazy. I'm going to put that on the uh, attack spot. Okay, so we got... Oh, I did get the laser pistol. I didn't know that. Okay. Thinking I'll put the modified Kraken where the pistol goes, maybe. Yeah, I'll just do that. Let's see how it goes. See how this one does. I may have to change the field of view. I'll probably reduce it from 120 down to maybe 105 or 110 because shooting things is kind of difficult because my arms are so far in front of me but I love the way it looks it's nice it's it's comfortable it's looting simulator that's what this is apple bites yum oh, there's a pirate hey yeah oh he's running oh oh hello Sir, I need you to get down from there. Where'd you go? You appear to be prioritizing our deaths over your own survival. Damage registered. Once life Oh, okay. It's gonna blow up. All right. Activity detected at close range. There we go. In combat, Barrett often yells, "Pew, pew, pew." I am not sure. You are gaining CO two, and oh, you will take damage instead. What? Why? I do not hear it, but I hear it is. 
Oh, sir. Oh, wow. Have much ammo for either of these guns. Not good. Ooh, weapon case. What we got? Equinox. What is that? What is that? Got a fancy weapon. Oh, is this the one from the trailer? 2,400 value? Alright, let's uh, pop, put it right there. Let's see how it does. Only got 26 rounds for this thing. Let's see what I can do with it. Pharmaceutical lab. Whoa. Oh, I can make some bandages? Okay. Yeah, I think I have plenty already, though, but... Right. I'll just go ahead and craft one. Okay. Well, that's one more uh, bandage. We got some fiber, aluminum, antimicrobial. Ooh, we got some important stuff here. There we go. That's probably used to like create other things. We got anything else? Whenever I finish up this part one, I'm thinking about uh, adjusting the field of view and some other settings. It would be It'll look a little bit different when I play again. To leave some things behind. <laughs> yeah, you think? It would seem I'm like drastically overweight, but I seem fine. Like I don't know if this is gonna impact anything. Oh, you know, I think I just now noticed. I'm overweight, and I'm sure you guys probably saw this, and probably screaming at your screens right now. Uh, it is consuming my O2 to just simply walk. Captain and Tommy, so, Protocol Indigo, may I take some things? I'm gonna give you some of my stuff. Alright, now that that's dealt with, I should be able to loot, like, important things now, instead of just anything I come across. Uh, oh, hello. Hit hard. You were trying to kill me. Demoralizing rip shot. Okay. I am aiming for your center of mass. Use a health pack. Um, I think basic ingredients and stuff are good to grab. They don't weigh too much. And they're useful. I only have five rounds left. I have to swap. Oh, I'm almost out of ammo in general. I wonder if you can make ammo. We're definitely gonna have to do a lot of that. Enemy <laughs> it's a big molecule extractor. Why is that thing so big? It's loose. The terramorph is loose. We can't stop it. When when we tried to sync with the neural control interface, it just completely flipped out. Broke through its containment chamber like it was made out of paper. It kills Michelson, Cobb, and Sumatri in all of one minute. I'm, I'm not even sure where it is now. It took off deeper into the facility. A, a security detail went in after it, but good friggin' luck. When I know it's safe, I'm going to make a run for the comm relay. Try to call in the cavalry. This is Hayden Wynn, lead xenobiologist. 
Wishing he had gone to dentist school like his parents wanted. Oh no. Uh, okay, I'll undo that one. Uh, let's see. Hmm. I'm thinking I'll do this, then this, then. This. Uh, that. Yay. Shotgun shells, okay. I mean, whatever. I'm detecting a safe nearby. We could make use Are of you? whatever is inside, provided you had some digi picks and a disregard oh, another for one? personal property rights. Oh. oh my god. Hair. There we go, another one. We're all dead. The comms relay has been trashed. The whole room is trashed. We can't call for help. I can hear the terror morph roaring somewhere. And more people screaming. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Alright. Medpack, amp, and... Look at that, we got a Berserker Grendel. And a bunch of materials. Oh, wrong button again. Alright, what is a Grendel? I can't remember what that is. Ah, okay, that's what that is. Alright, well I'm gonna put this... Right... Where the Kraken is, since it does the same damage. Berserker does more damage the less armor one has. Radioactive. Randomly deals radioactive damage and demoralizes the target. Demoralizing. Small chance to demoralize a target. Okay. Um, that 25% damage and attack speed is hard to beat, but since it's a legendary, I'll go ahead and uh, just go ahead and put it right here instead. I got 300 rounds of that. I might as well use this. Here we go. Hey. You gotta be oh, hello. Me. The frontier has a new captain. You working with Barrett, or did you pry the ship keys out of his cold, dead hands? Oh no, you see, we weren't really after Barrett. We're after that ship. Every Crimson Fleet rook hears about the frontier. That constellation keeps treasure hidden in the cargo bays. The loot from a hundred planets. That statement is partially correct. The frontier has been to many planets and moons, but the only things held in the cargo bays are spare parts, dust, desiccated food particles, and a variety of species of ant. I don't care what kind of lies <laughs> okay. program that robot to say. We're taking that ship. Um. Hmm. I try to persuade. You're not talking us out of this score. Ah. Uh, to persuade a person, you need to make successful choices. Choices can range from kind words to distractions to threats. Oh. Each choice has a difficulty. The higher the difficulty, the greater the chance the choice fails, but the more points you'll earn when you succeed. You have a limited number of choices you can make, but you can never fail if your last choice succeeded. Okay, so it's best to try and continue the conversation with the extra dialogue lines to see if you can, like, soften them up. Okay. Well, this is interesting. Return. <laughs> what? What is this? Um, hey, if you want to trade ship, that sounds good to me. The frontier creaks when it turns anyway. I'm not falling for that. Your ship is loaded, and we want it. Aw. 
You have it wrong. Constellation is an explorer's group. They aren't treasure hunters. They aren't? You sure? The ship doesn't have anything on it. You're chasing a fairy tale. You're lying. We're getting uh, what's on that ship. I've well. heard enough out of you. Kill them! Dang. I'm really hoping I could win that. Oh, there we go. That's how you throw a grenade. Oh my. Is there another one? Oh, we got a bunch of pirates over there. Alright, well, I'm gonna loot real quick. Oh, they're leaving! Oh, I'm gonna see if I can get on the ship. this all right where's the other guy at where you at oh there you are Another one. What else we got? What is he doing on the? <laughs> Alrighty. Oh, so horrible with, with this gun. Is there more? Oh my gosh, how many are there? They must have just dropped them off and took off. Y'all lucky, I almost got your ship. Where'd he go? Did he die? Oh, hello. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Awesome. Alright, so I can fast travel to your ship, press LB to open the scanner. Okay, so you can just do it from your scanner? Oh, isn't that nice? That's so nice of them. Captain Tommy, to reach the launch, we must jump to the planet Jemison in the Alpha Centauri system, and then land in the city of New Atlantis. Do not worry. This will all become second nature before too long. Yeah, I have no doubt. Alright, so I'm thinking uh, we'll go to the next planet that we're supposed to go to. Demison will land, talk a little bit, and then I'll conclude this as a part one, and I will pick it up in a part two after. Alright, let's see. Take off. Let's go. Oh, you can fast travel directly from the mission thing. Okay. Here we go. And I'll go ahead and lower the speed down. And let's see. Like missions in the bottom section. Okay. Press X to automatically plot a course to your next objective. Oh. Fuel consumption. There we go. Oh, I wish there wasn't a load screen though. Entering no contraband ship. 
Ooh, entering patrolled area. go there right land okay so you can activate the scanner while you're in the ship and then it'll let you just automatically choose it just like when you're on the planet you can just hit land and boom there we go go. New Atlantis. Hey, Bosco. What? Let me guess. Protocol Indigo again? Yep. <laughs> Your memory is uncanny. It's funny. And he's our new captain. My crew can take a look at your ship. And you can stop by the trade authority kiosk if you need to offload some cargo. Cool. I'd like it. Wow. Let me see what you got for I'm sale. Sure you can find something you like. Wow. I got 7,000 credit. Rambler. Galileo. 132,000 credit? Thing's pretty big, though. Kind of hole. Okay. Field breaker. Ooh, look at that laser. Maxed out. Oh, this thing's better in all regards. 279,000 credits. Oh my. If I want to get one of these things, I'm going to have to farm. Either that or just pick it up on my next playthrough. That's a lot of engines. Eesh. This thing's nice. 940 hull. I might grab this sucker someday. All right. Everything looks good here. I'll be at my booth if you need me. All right. This place is massive. I can assure you this unprovoked attack on the United Colonies research facility will not go unanswered. Cool. Okay. Huh. <laughs> they scan you for a bounty? That's crazy. Alright. This place is massive. I don't even think I'm actually in the city yet. I guess I gotta go to the Mast District. Here we go! Oh, I wanna watch it go. I'm so excited to see Tony after work. Are ya? Good for you. Oh my god. Top off my aesthetically health. pleasing. Or so Barrett has told me. New Atlantis relies on advanced hydroelectrics for most of its power. Okay. Nice. You see that scientist out in front of Mast? Staring at trees, sounds upset. Whatever it is, it can't be that bad, right? We may be in a United Colonies city, but Constellation is an entirely neutral entity, and always has been. 
Okay. Good to know. Here we are. The lodge. The front door should unlock if you hold up the watch that Baron gave you. I have messaged the other members of Constellation. They will be waiting for us inside. Ooh. There we go. Captain Tommy, everyone will be in the library, just inside. If Barrett were here, he'd probably tell you that you're part of something bigger now, and he hopes you'll make this place your home. All right. Well, I will pick it up from here in a part two. This will conclude part one. Now might be a little bit different than usual or what you're mostly used to but if you guys want to stick around i am going to say a prayer for everyone watching and for everyone to have an awesome rest of the day or rest of the night so you can listen or you can say it with me if you like here we go dear god please guide and lead us today help us to make wise decisions and to trust in your plan for our lives May we have the strength to follow your will and to be obedient to your word. Dear God, please give us the courage to face any challenges that come our way today. In Jesus' name, amen. You guys have a wonderful day. I will upload a part two as soon as possible. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe if you enjoyed. And have a good one.